Good morning, Tightliners, and welcome back to the channel. Uh, on the end, or the inside of the end of the pre-quarter today, uh, this morning, um, specimen hunting, seeing what I can find. Ballon Ras being the prime target. Um, baits, I've got Beela Crab, I've got Ragworm, I've got Black Lug. And I've also got some fish baits as well, just in case there's might be a ray or something out there. Who knows? So anyway, I'm going to fish a very simple rig. Very simply put together rig. One no hook there. Another one no hook by there. And it's going to be start off with a crab. This is a spot I used to fish a lot when uh, Fionn was a, a small child, when we were allowed to drive on to here. What I used to do was I had a big hatchback and she could play in the back with her Lego and do some drawing and what have you and I was here fishing and we were both happy. Anyway, so we'll have a go with some crab first, looking for that ballon and then I'll start putting out some other baits, see what else I can find. So that's the plan, and then as I'm walking off here later, I have a few more casts with the feathers, see if I can put some more mackerel in the freezer. So I'll see you in a second. Right, so I've got a second one in now. Similar rig to what I showed you. So that one's got all ragworm on. And then what I've got now is I've got my LRF stuff, I've got a little bit of crab leg on that one, a little bit of ragworm on there, and I'm going to have a go down the side. In what's known as Corcoran Corner, down over here. It's just likely now that that stinking dog will start on to my tail and I'll miss it. Hope you're all doing well. The weather's been weird. Wind swinging from one direction to the other. Heavy rain on the most sunshine and ice. And the wind's cold. Let's see if we can add anything to this figure. I'm currently on 24. I had the macro the other day looking for that. Well, guys, first fish of the morning. It is the wrong, wrong species of wrasse, really. Beautiful corquin. I don't know if you can spot the colours in that. Beautiful colours. Really nice orange eyes. That was on the LRF, right in close. But uh, nothing happening on the bigger baits as yet. Let's get this beautiful, beauty fish back. Ugh, can't get my words out there. Little beautiful fish back. Nomachudig. 
Dry case, second fish, another beautiful Corquin Russ. The colours are absolutely superb on them. Look at that. It's very slow here. I'd have thought I'd have had a couple of rattles on the bigger baits by now. Let's get this beauty back. There we go. Got it. <laughs> no more cutting. Well, guys, I missed the bite earlier on the crab bait, but now I think I might have found what the culprit was. Yeah, the snotty little boot lace conger eel. Not what I'm after. Not unless it's going to be about 15 times bigger. There we go. Let's get it back. That's definitely what not what I wanted. I thought I was going to be into my ballon then. But at least it's a fish. And uh, we got something on the bigger bait. That's the second conger now I've had on the Universal Match. Let's get the bait back out there and let's just hope but the next one will be a ballon. So hopefully what that proves is, is that I am in the rough stuff. And that's where I need to be if I'm going to get a ballon. Right, so I can tell us in the rubber head off. I think I might have another fish on here. Do I? What is it? And there we go, guys. Targets achieved. Ballon Rass at last. Right, let's get this photographed and let's get it returned. Get in, species number 25 for the year. And that makes me level, as far as I know now, with Kay and Dave. Yes. Right, no more Right guys, so I've just had a phone call off my daughter who's in dance class and she's forgotten to take something with her. So I'm going to have to walk right off the breakwater now, go home, pick up what she wants, take her to her in the town hall in town. And then what I might do is come back and just fish for the mackerel. Target is achieved, it's up to species 25. I may continue, or this video will continue probably somewhere else later on. Normal today. Right guys, I've just had a message from Fionn saying that she's been able to get what she wanted from somebody else. So, now I've had my target, I'm going to try and see if I can get a bigger reel out of there. So, mackerel head going in. 150 pound. On a pulley. Let's get a scent. go. Let's see if there's a big eel in there. 
not holding up a much in daylight, but I never know, could be. So I've got now, I'm going to give this half an hour and then I'm going to go down there and fish for some mackerel. What I'll do as well is I'll have a little play down the side still, just in case I can get another species and get one ahead of Dave and Kay. No more could Right guys, so nothing else here now. Packed up everything again and now I'm going to go further down the breakwater, see if I can get some more mackerel. I say more mackerel, it's on Tuesday morning. I had a walk up here and I had about 15, 16 mackerel. So if I can get a few more for the freezer, that'd be really good. So, I'll bring you back when I get there. No more One other thing though before I go. Disappointing again. Whole bag load of rubbish. Somebody's taken the bother to put it in a bag, but not just then, and then just left it here. It is angling stuff. There's bait wrappers. There's some, I don't know what, I've never seen it before. Some sea paste or something. Anyway. I'll take it with me. No right guys, I've arrived now at the third steps and I'm going to have a go here, see if there's any mackerel. Whew, that was a warm walk. No more dig. There's a lot less water here today than there was the other day. We're catching them really close in. I've only got a few minutes left, 10 minutes maximum, I think. Yeah. Got to be back in town for two o'clock. Just get two or three, be good. Guys, I hope you like what you're seeing. If you do, please like and subscribe. I know that there's a few people watch who are not subscribers. It would be very nice if you could subscribe. Thank you. Hey, hold that one. Right guys, so the plan is go home now, I'll pick you on up, go home, have some lunch, um, I'll sort out the bag, no, no, I'll sort out the box and what have you, and I am planning, hopefully, to get out with Kay later on after tea. more past and I'm gonna have to get on the road.
Today, I think, is the uh, calm before the storm. It's going to be pretty nasty over the weekend. There was meant to be a match on here on Sunday, but that's been moved to Kemlin. Uh, Hollyhead club match. Have a look at Hollyhead and District Angling Club on Facebook. Have a look at Winnie's Worms Facebook for times. Don't look as if there's many mackerel here today. Seems to be better early morning. So we'll see what the weather's like in the morning. And if it's not too bad, I might sneak down here for a bit. One more cast, and then I'm going to have to go. Well, it's warm now. Don't really need this big coat on, but it's just easier to carry it on than to carry it any other way. Didn't know what the weather was going to do earlier on. It looked like it was going to rain. That's the end of that for, to, for now. So the next time you see me be in a different location and hopefully with Kay. Namakadi. Right guys, unfortunately the weather turned vile. So uh, Kay and I decided that we uh, weren't going to go out in that. Um, we are going to try and fish all day Saturday and then a the Hollyhead Angling Club match on Sunday in Kemlin. Uh, today is Friday. This is the morning after now, obviously, um, and the weather, the wind is up big time. And uh, yeah, so today it's going to be a day of match preparation, some rigs made, and uh, spend some time with Catherine and Fion. Catherine's not working today, so that's what's going to be today. Um, at least in the session on the breakwater, the uh, targets was achieved, and now I am up there with Kay and Dave on 25 species for the year. Now then, I was hoping that I could add a few more than that during the uh, Easter holidays. Who knows though, in one of the venues that we're planning to go um, this, this weekend, um, place could be high on the agenda there. Anyway guys, hope you enjoy what you see. Please like and subscribe if you can. Also, don't forget that the merchandise is available. Um, details can be found at the start and at the end of every video. So until the next time guys, keep your eyes tight.